AIO Media, and today we're here with Marcy from Tutu Q Boutique. Hello, Miss Marcy. Can you tell us a little bit about your business? So I am a clothing designer, and I'm also an event decorator, and I've been doing it for a little bit over 10 years. Alrighty. And so I'm trying to like expand out into like florals and adult clothing. Uh -huh. So that's a little bit of what I do. Okay, that's really cool. What got you into the business of uh, doing clothes and stuff like that? So I had my baby girl really young at the age of 18. So she's the one who kind of motivated me to do something different while I was able to stay at home with her. So that's how I got started. That's really cool. Thank you so much for allowing us to interview you. Thank you. You're welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello, AIO Media, and today we're here with Marissa Nicholson. And what what business are you a part of today? So I'm here with Young Invincibles. Young Invincibles is a national, nonpartisan, nonprofit organization committed to elevating the voices of young adults ages 18 to 34 in the political process and creating economic opportunity for our generation. <laughs> oh my God, that was perfect. <laughs> How long have you guys been in business? So we've been in business for two uh, since. 2009, almost at 2009 years. <laughs> Alrighty, that's a really long time. What got you into this or what made you interested into this? So Young Invincibles is really cool because I really wanted an organization that um, not only said something, but actually stood on what they uh, preach. For example, um, we have four core issue areas, which is healthcare, higher education, workforce development, and civic engagement. And what's really cool about Young Invincibles is that mental health falls under healthcare, and Young Invincible believes in like self-care. And what they do as an organization is they will pay their employees once a, uh, one Monday out of each month to be off for Mental Health Monday, where you're not working and you get paid to do so. Aside from that, um, the advocacy skills and being able to advocate with other young adults. What's really cool about Young Invincibles is that you don't have to like speak the jargon. You don't have to go to school for political science. You just have to want your, your neighbor to be doing better. And learning those advocacy skills, this was like the perfect place to be. That's amazing. That's really good. That's really good to hear. And thank you so much for allowing me to interview you. It was yes, nice to meet you thank guys. Thank you. You too. Hello. Today, AIO Media is here with... Sky with Tasty Messy Soul Cakes. Nice to meet you, Miss Sky. Can you tell me a little bit about your business in the background? Yes, so I am a mom of nine that started a business, a cake business, because uh, I want to leave a legacy to my children. I started baking when I was seven years old because my grandmother, she couldn't do it. She was paralyzed. They had to roll her in there so she can taste the things that she want to taste, and I just took it and ran with it. And it's been a success so far. That's amazing. What type of goals do you have for your business moving forward? So we should be in a storefront really soon. Within the next three months, uh, we're planning on being in a storefront and um, taking over Houston. Taking <laughs> Period. <laughs> yes, yeah, so uh, I don't know if I should say this, but you know, the nothing but cakes. Uh -huh. I'm just a black version of the nothing but cakes. That's amazing. I'm and we're here to support all the black Ooh, businesses. I'm trying to tell you. It was so nice to meet you, Miss Guy. Thank you for the interview. Hello, today AIO Media is here with Charlene. Nice to meet you. Can you tell me a little bit about your business and the name? Yes, it's called the Beauty Bar, and what I specialize is in health and wellness all over. So I have appetite suppressant as long as, um, along with beauty supply and Yanni Steam. So I do it all. You do a little do bit it of all. everything. Yeah, bit of everything. Can you tell me a little background on what got you into the business? Uh, myself. Okay. Yes, yeah, myself. Um, I was a, um, a little bigger than what I am now, so I wanted to lose some weight. So I just checked out different um, products, and I noticed that I needed to detox. And so I started detoxing a lot because I know that would help. I mean, that would um, hold our weight sometimes. So I detox, and along with detoxing, I do um, body contouring. So I did body contouring to help tighten me up. and. Um, Right along Yanni Steamer to help cleanse my body out naturally. <laughs> That's amazing to hear. I think everybody is more into the more healthier and herbal ways of getting rid of things. And that's amazing. Um, is there any way that they can contact you, social media? Yes, um, snatchbodylux at gmail.com. Alrighty, thank you so much for allowing me to interview you. It was nice to meet you. Hello, AIO Media, and today we're here with... Oh, it's Bree of Envious Me. It's nice to meet you, Miss Bree. What got you started into the business? Tell me a little bit about it and a background on it. Oh, of course, Envious Me is number, number one source for all things jewelry. We sell jewelry that's clean, classic, modern. Clean, classic, modern jewelry brand. Try to make sure that we're inducing confidence in each and every person that we touch. Also, we based off 
resilience, positive affirmation, and motivation. That is amazing to hear. What got you into the business? What made you want to start it? Well, my own personal motivation story, my own personal resilience story. When I was 18, I was actually shot by a police officer, oh, wow. and he shot me in my left hand. Seeing that he saw a shiny object, which was actually my bracelet. Mm -hmm. So what I did was I just took the pain from the trauma of that and turned it around. Yeah. That's amazing Thank to you. hear. That's an amazing story, Thank though, you. honestly. Thank you. It, it took me a long time to get here. Right. To even just talk about it and just free flow yeah. with it like this. Oh, yeah, girl. It took you a while oh, to break yeah, that down, oh, heal from it. Oh, yeah. I'm still, I'm still working on that. I'm still working on that for very, sure. That's something very big to conquer and get over. <laughs> Thank that's, you. I'm proud of you, girl. Thank you. Do your I thing. It. Is there anything that you would say to anybody who's wanting to start a business or wanting to come up into the industry in Houston? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Honestly, I know it might sound crazy or you probably hear this all the time, but, like, just do it, right? Just start. Mm -hmm. uh, start somewhere, whether it's you sitting down looking through websites trying to go through names to see if the domain is taken whether it's you looking through logos whether it's you trying to source through product uh even if it is etsy or alibaba or whatever they call i don't i don't use those sites but i'm just saying if that's how you got to start then that's how you got to start yeah that's an amazing thing is there any way that they can reach out to you social media of course first off the seo on point so you can always just go to google and type in five letters that's N V S M E. Now that's five letters now, N V S M E. Also, you can always go to www.nvsme.com. Instagram is at Shop Envious Me Jewelry, and you're going to find everything else on there. Alrighty, thank you so much for allowing me to interview you. It was nice to meet you. Oh, likewise. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, today for AIO Media, we have the Sean's Luxury Experiences. Alrighty, and what's the name of your business? And give me a little background on it. Hello, tonight with AIO Media we have Sanishia. Nice to meet you. Can you tell me a little bit about your business and the name? Yes, so my business is LaShawn's Luxury Experiences. For my business, we offer pretty much any and everything that you could possibly ever need for your event. Balloons, treats, rentals, caterers, different things like that. Just because I know as a mom and as like a regular, you know, party person, it's very stressful going through different people to get all of your party needs. So my business just offers everything under one umbrella and so all you have to do is worry about one thing. And the best thing about my business is it doesn't matter how big the event is, how small it is, what, it, what theme it is, it doesn't matter because we all provide the luxury experience for you. That's amazing. Can you give me a, a, cup, a little background on what got you into the business? Yes, so it started off as a chocolate covered strawberry business that I did, um, I want to say, right after I graduated high school in 2018. And as time just went on over the years, I just started adding to it. I started doing cupcakes, pretzels, Oreos, different things like that. And as of last year, I decided to expand it to a full-blown event business because I throw so many parties for my kids and myself and family members and things like that. And I was just like, why not make it to a, an entire thing as a whole? Bro. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I'll tell you is there any way that they can contact you and get in touch with you social media wise? Yes. So my phone number is 281 771 8950. My Facebook account is LaShawn's Luxury, as well as my Instagram account is LaShawn's Luxury as well. That's actually really good. Really, your strawberries are really fresh. Thank you. Thank you. I can honestly say with that part of my business, I'm very, very particular about where I get my strawberries from and the size of them. So I will literally go to five different stores just to find the perfect strawberry. That's amazing. A lot of people don't put in that much time yes. into their, yes. yeah, their craft. Well, yes. Thank you so much. You're welcome.